If from today you've only ever used these very basic, simple yet effective drone shots correctly for the rest of your videos, your videos will tell a far better story than if you didn't use them at all or if you use them inconsistently. Hey, I'm Tamara and my channel is all about helping you to create better videos with helpful tips, tricks and tutorials and in this video I want to help you start off with three very simple drone shots that will help you get on your way to telling better stories within your videos. One of the best uses of a drone when storytelling is to use it as a tool for getting establishing shots. And establishing shots are what help to set the scene and give context, whether that's introducing the beginning of a story or ending the story. Establishing shots provide a sense of place to a viewer and should really be seen as an accompaniment to the rest of your footage. There are loads of drone shots that you can use, but starting at the beginning with this basic fundamental of storytelling will get you well on your way to telling great stories. So first up, let's start with the beginning of the story. And for this, you can use a bird's eye view shot. This is great for conveying a full space, like for example, a city or a forest or anything like that. For this shot, you just need to point your camera downwards and fly slowly over the landscape. The direction that you fly doesn't necessarily matter as long as you're heading to the main location or the main subject. The other shot that you can use in order to begin your story is a push-in shot. This one's great for communicating to your viewer that they're basically going to be taken into a specific location. For this, you can literally just fly your drone in a straight line towards the location or the subject, but make sure that your subject or the main location dominates the frame, either by using the rule of thirds or placing them in the centre of the frame so that they take up most of that frame. You can also combine this with a downwards movement drawing the viewer in closer. The next shot is the reveal, which is also another move that gives your viewer context as to where you're going to take them, or lets them know that you want them to focus on a specific subject. If you want to reveal a location or a subject, moving left or right is a great way to do this. All you have to do is start with your subject or focal point out of the frame and fly left or right to reveal it. You can also fly down as a reveal as well. Another great reveal shot is where you start low, fly up and move forwards at the same time. This shot is more so if you want to show off the location rather than take your viewer into it. The pullback is one of the best shots for letting your viewer know that the scene or the video is ending. All you need to do is simply fly backwards so that your subject or location gets smaller. You can also combine this with flying upwards at the same time. So that's it, the four very simple drone shots and moves that you can use to tell a better story. In the next video, I pair these shots with ground shots so that you can see how they work in context, so be sure to check that one out. Um, I hope you found this video useful. If so, do give the video a thumbs up and let me know in the comments below. Otherwise, thanks for watching. See you next time.